Yeah. Damn, 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 damn. Uh, Look. Uh, uh, nigga, you know me. Know me. Nigga, you know me. Just can't breathe, nigga. Breathe, nigga. Breathe. Yeah, yeah. Look. Uh, uh, yeah. Look, see me and my niggas just trying to get this loose leaf And this Remy, it got me all in my two three. We smoking band, no Reggie, no we don't shoot threes Niggas be lying, I'm only giving the truth, G, the black guy right. Oh shit, alright Kid Breeze, one half of the shipmates, you know what I'm saying Um, yeah, shit, I guess this is a uh, fucking insight on the valley and shit You know what I'm saying <laughs> Shit, was you gonna like ask me questions or some shit like that? Like what? Like what does it mean? Like substantially? Like, all right. So, like scientifically, a valley is the lowest place in between hills. You know what I'm saying? Or geographically, it's 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 it geographically is defined as a, a, a depression more long than it is wide you know what i'm saying which almost 99 percent has a river running through so with that being the case that's just applicable to to my life like in this current stages you know what i'm saying no matter what like no matter what the lowest point i may be at or you know for you know if I'm using this as an influential type thing, you may be at, you know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't no reason why you shouldn't progress, you know what I mean? So if we, if we talking like, you know, mirroring subjects, you got a valley that's a very low point, but it's a river flowing through it. And that, that could be anything, a river, a person, goddamn uh, animal, anything, it's something gonna always be moving through it. So no matter what, you know, Whatever your lowest point may be, or whatever you gotta do to progress, you feel me? Like that's 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 what you know. The valley is is all is all about. You know what I'm saying? Like my my different ways of maneuvering, being in the street, figuring out ways to you know flip bread. You know what I'm saying? Different shit like that. Although I may I, I may have been at a very low point. You know what I'm saying? Like it's always a way to you know to remain progressive. You know what I'm saying? So. In a nutshell, that's kind of, you know, what it represents, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. So, uh, right, so, um, you got, like, like I said, the, I said, like, the spectrum of the, of the fucking, to me, the spectrum of the rap industry doesn't vary that much, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, you got, like, ultra like weird dudes who like may not have come from you know as colorful as a background like lifestyle wise oh, yeah, baby. I'm <laughs> who may not have come like you know from that colorful of a, as of a background you know like growing up wise you know what i'm saying but still got stories to tell which entail might you know be some weird shit like you got a lot of weird ass rap niggas you know what i'm saying like but you know that's all a part of the game you know what i mean and then you got you know like overly thugged out niggas you know what i'm saying who find ways to channel their fucking depression through fucking violent and destructive music you know what i'm saying like so we not talking like a nigga who was out here in the streets pushing some coke, yeah, trying to, you know, get money to you feel, fund his career, feed his family. Like, we talking like, shoot him up, kill, kill, kill that nigga type shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, you know, like I said, like, you know, and in between there, you got niggas who can balance, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, shit, the state of the rap game as I see it now, shit, let me get up, let me get up in the anybody gonna say that you know what i'm saying but like let me shit i'll be the change that that, that so many speak of um i would have to say every day definitely 
You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, everyday shit is real, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, at a point in time, like, you know, I was dealing with a female who really ain't like what I was doing. You know what I'm saying? And she'd be telling me, like, why don't you find something better to do? You know what I'm saying? Why don't you, you feel me? Like, you smart, you educated black man. Why you out here, you know, doing that? Not saying, not saying she was judging me or knocking it or anything, you know what I'm saying? But she was asking it. Of course, she was saying that I shouldn't do it. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, fuck gonna pay me. You know what I'm saying? Who fuck gonna, you know what I mean? Like, all these fucking jobs out here, like, I'm, I'm out here with a degree. With no fucking job, and nobody want to fucking hire. You know what I'm saying? Like, not no position that that I find suitable to allow to go alongside with my career aspirations. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I just wasn't finna settle. So you know, what 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 I was doing was it risky? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, but shit. At the end of the day, it's like shit. I put my life on the line for this shit for real. Yeah. I mean, you know, like I said, ain't no knock to no, you know, all my niggas got nine to five. No knock to them, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's still a hustle, you know what I'm saying? Like, no no knock at all, you know what I mean? I just honestly feel like when you truly deep down want to be an artist or, you know, a creative, at some point, you know what I'm saying, you have to, you got to let go of your gig, you know what I'm saying? Like, whenever, and I'm not saying like going fucking quit your fucking job when you got bills and shit to take care of, that's stupid. You know what I'm saying? But like once you get to a certain point where you plateau and you like, all right, I'm at a point where I could look for the next job and be all right, you know what I'm saying? Like I could still, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm in a position where I'm gonna be straight. Yeah, I mean, well, yeah, yeah, bro. I, honestly, like 90% of the time, it starts out with a beat. Like, I'm in a crib or, you know, wherever I'm at. And I, like, I got an idea for a beat or whatever, and I start making a beat, you know what I'm saying? And once it gets to a certain bounce or something, you know, a certain a certain component of the beat that makes me like it and want to turn it into a song for me, you know what I'm saying? Like, I instantly, like, start thinking of, like, ideas of hooks and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Like, and then once I do that, once I feel like I can make a complete song out of it, I, I, I make a verse out of the beat, you know what I'm saying? Like a, a, a verse and a hook, you know what I mean? Like, so by that time, I probably got a hook, you know what I'm saying? Or, you know, even if I don't got a hook, like I said, 90% of the time, the process starts with a beat. So whether the beat already finished and I just realize once it's done, like, man, this shit kind of dope, you know, maybe I can use, you know, or when I'm first starting, I'm chopping the sample, I'm laying the chords, I'm like, damn. I need this, you know what I'm saying, I already know, you know what I mean, like, so, you know, it's it's rare that, you know, it's it's very rare that I've started writing a verse, like, without a beat, you know what I'm saying, like, I ain't just like, you know, now I have written things to other beats, or like, you know, older beats that I made, that I either never put the song out, or didn't really feel like it was a good enough verse, or, you know, and I've taken pieces from those verses and made new songs out of it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I swear to God. All right. Shit, man, Black Air Max, man, that like, you know, like it was a point, bro, like I was really, like I say on goddamn, like, swear to God, I don't need a banger because I'm running in and I'm sticking up. Like it was a point, bro, like, you know, I was down financially. You know what I mean? Like, not, not like super fucked up, you know what I'm saying? But I needed, I needed some shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was in the mindset, like, I was taking nigga shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, really gonna run up on a nigga, you feel me, who I felt didn't deserve what he had, fucking rob this nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, but the more rational me, you know what I'm saying, was like, you know what, bro, like, real shit, you facing 10 to 15, you know what I'm saying, running up on a nigga with a pistol, you know what I'm saying, like, and then the end of the day, who walking around with more than five, six hundred dollars in their pocket, you know what I'm saying, so you gonna risk 10 to 15, running up on a nigga, or running up in a nigga trap, or, you know what I'm saying, like, you gonna risk, you know, your life, you know what I mean, because you need whatever you need that bad, you know what I'm saying, whether it's a stain or not, you know what I'm saying, so, you know, I'm just like, 
in the mold, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, man, nigga, don't let me, you feel me? Like, I'm gonna get blacked up, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I'm, and I'm, and I'm really, you feel me? I'm gonna do it, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, the men be trying to reach for whatever you get. Spread this shit the fuck out, you know what I'm saying? Like, but you know, like I said, like, I'm like, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, nah, you know what I mean? Like, motherfucker. Motherfucker do that, you feel me? Like, the shit you doing in full, you putting this shit at risk, you know what I mean? Like, so, you know, I was just in the mode when I was writing that. Black, black hood, black, black pants, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, all that, you know what I mean? Like, and then throughout the song, you know what I'm saying? Just going to, you know, just going into detail about the state, the state of, you know, my mindset where I was at right now, you know what I'm saying? Like, she just, you know, and kept that kept that mind that mind frame throughout that writing process so it's real dark real eerie you know what i'm saying but it's a bouncy beat with a nice hook so motherfuckers is you feel me <laughs> dancing and celebrating through the depression you know what i'm saying like niggas is like really like oh this shit dope but they all know like motherfuckers was on some shit bro you know what i'm saying like but but that's the beauty in art, bro. You know what I'm saying? I took that frustration and I turned that into a, a, a real nice song. You know what I mean? So. You know, the, uh, the dual consciousness of, of the black man in the urban society. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to understand, like, motherfucker walking around. This nigga's walking around here, bro, that can't fucking eat, bro. So, like. And they aggravated, irritated. They're like, bro, what the fuck? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, why this nigga walk around shining, bro? Like, what he doing to shine that I ain't doing or that I don't have the opportunity to do? You know what I'm saying? Like, so instead of going up to that brother and trying to learn how to fish, you gonna poke him for his shit. You know what I'm saying? You gonna hate on him, man. You gonna blow him down. You gonna fuck about his family. You gonna fuck about none of that. You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's a real thing that people gotta realize. You know what I'm saying? That that niggas in the hood go through every day, every day, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, niggas, like, niggas ain't thinking about the long route, you know what I'm saying? Niggas ain't worried about, like, how, how to work to get that shit. They just see a nigga that got it and think that he just came up or, you know, he was granted, blessed with opportunity that they wasn't, you know what I'm saying? Blowing the fuck down, you know what I'm saying? For no reason, really, you know. Wow, well, I, I just had the reason, you know what I'm saying? My favorite, all right, so my favorite pair of J's, well, of course, my favorite pair of Nikes, actually, let me start with the Nikes. Favorite pair of Nikes is the MX-95, of course. I mean, I mean, granted, outside of, like, the Air Force One, like, you know, the fucking Air Max 95 OG lime colorway, like the, you know, the, you know, the original gray and lime joints. Mike's, I have to say the black and white Taxi 12s. You know what I'm saying? Only because, like, before I was able to ever really get mics like that, them was the ones I'd see and be like, bro, I give me some Jordans. I'm a kid. I'm like four or five. Like, when I give me some Jordans, they're going to be the ones I get. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, definitely, definitely number one. I could go on and on for mics, man, because I'm a, I'm, a, I'm, a I'm a shoe dude. But, you know, if I had to pick, we're going to go with the Neon 95s. In the uh, black and uh, ta the taxi twelves. Yeah. Nah, man. I mean, you know, shit. Like I said, the valley, bro. Like this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas don't understand. Like it's a, a very cohesive, substantial, but transparent project. So when you listen to it, you know what I'm saying? Like ain't no fucking lies in the raps. Like no, this is made up. You know what I mean? Like, I ain't saying you gonna listen to it and hear me talking about killing motherfuckers and blowing niggas shit back and, you feel me, moving bricks of cocaine and all type, you know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't nothing like that, but, you know, the shit, any, every line that you hear is real. You know what I'm saying? Like, and it ain't, you know, it's, it's the truth. That's, that's all I can say, you know what I mean? Like, and I just want motherfuckers to fuck with it and be able to touch motherfuckers that can relate, man. Like, be able to touch recent college graduates, bro, like, who just don't got the opportunity, you know what I'm saying? Like, who who not trying to go into the workforce, you know what I mean? Like, not trying to, you feel me, conform to the norms of society, bro. Like, they really want to, you know what I'm saying, do this shit for themselves. Whatever they want to do, rap, sing, 
fucking model, video, whatever, you know what I'm saying, whatever, whatever it is, you know what I mean, like, that requires their own time and own investments, this who this, this is who I do it for, motherfuckers who took that leap of faith, bro, you feel me, who, who made sacrifices on lifestyles, you know what I'm saying, like, because ultimately that shit is going to pan out for you and like, if not a superstar fashion in a blue collar way. Lord forgive me, use your name in vain, but through the joys and through the pain, God damn, 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 take a moment, got some weight above me, holy soul, me, gotta shake him off me, God damn.